One June day in 1902, Edvard Munch came across four young girls who lived on his street in Oskarstrand. The girls wore dark clothing in mourning for their recently deceased grandmother. Perhaps it was the impression of childlike innocence, clad in bereavement, that gave Munch the impulse to paint the group picture of the girls standing beneath the high foundation wall of their house. A while ago, the Munch Museum received a photographic portrait of five small girls, and it turned out four of them were the sisters in Munch's painting. The fifth was still an infant when Munch painted the picture, so the photo was taken a year or two later, in 1903-04. The girls are easily recognizable from the painting. All of them had double first names. Anna Ulava, born in 1892, Jødis Natalia, born in 1896, Edle Helene, born in 1897, Ruth Agnes, born in 1900, and Sigri Ayarona, born in 1902. Ayarona is a name their father coined from the initials of the four oldest sisters. The picture was probably taken to be mailed to their father, who was a tugboat skipper in the harbor of New York City and was rarely home in Oskostrand. Munch's friend and patron, Max Linde in Lübeck, wrote to him in April 1903, I hope you can soon come and paint the children once again, like the little girls you recently exhibited at Kassirer in Berlin. The Linde boys were very keen on the painter and were constantly asking, when is Uncle Munch coming? And in the spring of 1903, Munch painted Dr. Linde's four sons, in a similar composition as the four girls. The picture is now considered to be one of the most important group portraits of the 20th century. In the summer of 1903, Munch painted two more pictures of the girls. They are all one year older, and their resemblance to the photograph is remarkable. In the first one, they're all clad in dark clothes, as in the painting from the previous year. In the second one, they're wearing light summer clothes, the same dresses as in the photo. And in 1905, Munch painted yet another picture of three girls in Oskostrand. The oldest, standing in the center, is Anna Ulava, who has now become a teenager. The youngest, at the right of the picture, is surely little Sigri Ayarona, the grandmother of the photograph's current owner. <laughs> 